daddy's boy. <laughs> Dad, look how excited he is. Eagly is Peacemaker's pet eagle, and that's Peacemaker's best friend. Why is there a bald eagle in your car? That's Eagly. Eagly is your pet eagle. Yeah. Do you have a daughter named Daughtery? <laughs> she also have a guy's pet eagle much? Peacemaker is kind of a dick to everyone. Hey, Sweet Cheeks, can you take my order real quick? Sweet Cheeks. But we see him with that eagle, and he becomes like a proud papa. Hey, boy. Learn to drive now? You gonna drive us home? Yeah. I think Eagly would be like a wonderful, obedient, lovable golden retriever, but an eagle. Hey, bud. God, just no shit, man. I thought you said it was friendly. Oh, I thought you meant friendly to me. We have a few ways to help John Cena when he's working with Eagly. We have what we call a stuffed eagle, but it's really a model built with chicken feathers and dyed to look like an eagle. Everybody kind of gets a feel for what an eagle will really feel like in this space. Which one's me and which one's Eagly? They've shared some heartwarming moments. Eagly's embraced and hugged him before. If we have a scene where John is touching him, we have a gray stuffed sack, basically. That will become Eagly's feathers ruffling up on his stomach. Everybody, look, look. He's never let me pet him before. That thing better not shit back there. You can't house train an eagle, dude. Not without stealing its soul. Our wonderful vendor, Weta, in New Zealand, is building him. So they obviously have a ton of creature experience, so we feel really happy to have them on the show. Eagly, take the helmet. Eagly, take the helmet. You hear the word eagly, and you think superhero universe, and you think maybe like a, a dude with a Birdman costume. No, it's an actual eagle, and a flawed one at that. He commonly overestimates Eagly's abilities. Which is great, because that's that's the universe we're in. Get back in the car and crinkle a bag or something. I don't think you have chips. These are bird chips.